Welcome to the stream, Super Metroid. Let's go. Starting again in the wrecked ship, where I last left off. Freaking atoms, molecules, whatever they are. These things are adorable. suit first. The ECW suit. That suits me well. Gravity suit now, I forgot. I think I'm on the right track here. All right, yeah, try. I am. There we go. Yeah, there we go. The ECW suit.
You know, Mega Man X came out in December 93, and then uh, this game came out sometime in 94. They both had the idea, I guess coincidentally, that uh, like the when you fight that boss in the beginning of Mega Man X, you can't win, you have to lose. Well, when you fight Ridley here for the first time, you can't beat him. You just make, the worst you can do is make him drop the Metroid jar, the jar where it contains a Metroid, and then he picks it up and flies off. So I was like, huh. At the time, that was a new thing to me, at least at the time. Uh, where you can't beat a boss, you have to like lose or not finish the battle, then you have to leave and fight, fight another time. That was a pretty cool concept. So they do that here also in Super Metroid, the first battle with Ridley. You can't really win the battle. If you're like retreat, if anything, or if you start to lose, like if you're low on energy, that's when she retreats and the time bomb is set. Pretty cool. Zombie, how's it going? Ah! I thought I missed it. Oh, work is work, right? Dun, 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 ECW. Yeah, it's got the gravity suit. I don't need to use the grappling beam so much over the water.
Is it done? It was good to see you stream again the other day, zombie. It's good to see you back. Awesome setup too you got in the background. ECW setup. No wonder it took you so long to get ready.
See that? Wasted my missile because I missed. Easy Missile, moron. W. Easy freaking W. Move out the way, idiot. Love this music. Now I'm going to just, just get as close to 100% as I can. And but I'll just, I do want to power up as much as I can though with the E-Tanks also. Before I get to the boss mer with Meridia. Because I made the mistake one time when I was trying to do a no death run. Of uh... Trying to beat Dragon with the grappling hook beam trick. But I didn't have enough energy to do it so I ended up dying. <laughs> I did beat the game that down though. It wasn't live. It was before I did live streams. It's it's a Super Metroid No Death Challenge I did in 2015. It's a video, but it, had, it took two attempts because I made that mistake. And I was like, man, this game is to me is I I can usually beat it without dying, no problem. And then 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 when I try to do it to show it to YouTube, I mess up.
Well, I might have done, I might have, I might have no death ran in 2008 also when I did a let's play of it, but I don't remember. Do, I wanted to do it in one run. Yeah, you make a stupid mistake in a no death run. I've done that before, making my X and others. It's frustrating. Ah, oh, you idiot. Ah. It's my friends. Is it up for you? Is it up you? Is it up you? ECW. Man, this controller is kind of broken would work better. Okay, I am doing exactly what I'm supposed to do. Small jump can be tricky, though. When I was a kid, I could not do it. Let me pull a Skip Rogers here and use my map. Ah, watch out. That's just seeing these things come at you in real life. Go as one of these for Halloween. I've seen a video where the uh, this dog was dressed in a tarantula suit or something, running around parking garages and on the streets or wherever, and scaring people. It was freaking hilarious. I would have ran like crazy too. And they decorated the place to where it looked like uh, dead bodies were in, the, in a giant spider web or something. And then the dog comes out running because the dog's friendly, just wants to love people. But it's wearing a tarantula suit. And as people see that after seeing the big spider webs and fake dead bodies attached to the spider webs and just start running like crazy. It was freaking hilarious.
No, what has been through here? Then you go back down. What am I doing? Can't wait to get the spring ball to spring to action. Here we go. Plasma beam. Can't wait to get the plasma beam later on in Meridia. Do some more grinding here, farming, whatever you want to call it. Farmville. Can't farm in video games, so you can't play Farmville. Really?
No, wait. Got to get a reserve tank, an A tank in the wrecked ship. Right, yeah, the x-ray scope really helps out, man. It really makes you look everywhere before you knew the game well. It's kind of like the equivalent is the equivalent to Dracula's eyeball. Ah, well, I already broke that earlier. Forgot to come back. You now process Mother Brain's eyeball. Mother Brain vs. Dracula. I didn't see that. Was Mother Brain in uh, one of the Smash games? Ah. Uh. E E E C W. E C W. Imagine a gravity suit in real life. Just run through water like you are, like you're on land. Dun, 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 you see, dump here. Mother Brain, what about Father Heart? Thank you. 
Yeah, that is cool. Love that. What? Here we go. Nice. Thank you. 
What's your favorite Metroid game, Zombie? That's a dead end over here. What am I doing? Have you played Dread yet? Everybody streaming Dread, I'm over here streaming Super Metroid. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah, me either. It looks pretty cool, though. Is he done? Yes. <laughs> 
I always love entering Meridia like this. Easy dub. I learned that from seeing the commercial. Yeah, they did. Yep. Dang it, man. I can get that. I want to go and try it two more times. I'm not going to keep trying that over and over. I know I can get it, but... Man, it's got like, you got to be precise in where you, where you do that at. Man, it's so annoying, too. You got to hurry, too, because your charge is going to expire. Dang it, I messed it up right there. Ah, see? <laughs> Man. Make sure that door's open. No, it's not. I think I did too soon. Yes, I did it. Nice. Imagine trying to do a uh, a no hit run of this game, but when you do that uh, charge, what you what I just did to get that missile, you're gonna have to technically take a hit. There might be a few exceptions. Damn, douchebag, get out of here! E easy dub. Oh, I thought I had the spring ball. Not yet. Yeah. 
It can be frustrating to pull off. Alright, so after I defeat Dragon, I'm going to quit the stream and continue this another time. No. <laughs> Dang it. It's easier to do. I can't believe I messed it up. Oh man, stupid thing messed me up. Get out of here, man. Man, these things. That never happened to me before. There we go. Jeez. I should have known that was a dead end. Fake Metroids. No, I meant to. Oh man, I meant to use a regular bomb. I just missed. <laughs> wasted to make a power bomb right there. boss Tom jump Thank <laughs> you. 
and I found Dragon's lair through a friend. My friend was playing this game. He accidentally fell into the spikes right there and fell through the ground. It's like, oh, that's where. Huh, that's how you find his lair. Wow. Right, let's go. Because before I knew this trick, I think I learned that about in the player's guide. Before I learned this trick, I just, man, this battle was hard. And, and also before I learned how to use the charge beam to fight rather than wasting all the missiles on the bosses. Easy, dump, easy, dump, easy. Here we go. Easiest boss battle because of that. I know some people say, man, why don't you beat him for real? <laughs> I did beat him for real. I beat him the smart way, and that's not cheating. Nice. Got a space jump. All right, so that ends the stream right here. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you, Zombie, for hanging out hanging out in the chat on Twitch. I will see you guys later. Hope you guys have a good one. I'm Ron Moore. God bless, and take care.